but um, I, c- I can try at some point. And just come in with the oohs and ahs whenever you're feeling it. Oh, jeez, Louise. Or just do it all the time. I don't know. <laughs> okay, <go. laughs> My older sister whacked me in the throat with a hockey stick when I was only five years old. Now I have irrational throat fears. <laughs> well, first off, page and a two, we appreciate your five star review. But wait, <laughs> sorry, your older sister slashed you in the throat with a hockey stick. I mean, damn, you were only five years old. I'd say you actually have understandably rational throat fears. <laughs> I'd agree with that. <laughs> well, now I'm stuck. It's hard to move on. I was supposed to read and write about other reviews for this song, but I'm left wondering, just picking my guitar, did you need stitches, or did it leave a scar? We know our shit, we watch forensic files, yes. did the partial prints and DNA match the hockey stick profile. And whose hockey stick was this? Was it yours or was it hers? Has the evidence been pawned off to a play it against sports? Did you have it coming? Were you being a little bitch? No offense. Did you tattle tail like a little sister snitch? Or did you do? that annoying thing where you're copying stop copying everything she says did you feel pain Pain. or did it feel good inside that your older sister had somehow made you feel alive she was their first child back then their only child their princess and then you came along (laughs) Stole the spotlight and her hand-me-downs and the attention. She now has to share a room with bunk beds and the attention, the attention, the attention. But did she braid your hair? Drive you and your friends to the mall to spend hours on the phone when you just needed to talk? Was she in your wedding? Did she make a drunken toast about a childhood accident at the hockey goal post after all of these years? Can you forgive her for your irrational throat fears? Wow, Lovey, that's a good one. 